We just got the order. Seven Cali's. We're going back to the pad. We're going to check it out. Lupe's by Mason F College. F-bomb out. F-bomb out. Double wrapped. Double All right. Wrapped. Oh. They did not give enough sauce. Oh my God, that, that was a weak amount of sauce. Oh no. And we don't have any left over. <laughs> oh no. We're eating dry burritos tonight, boys. Oh, oh, gee, that's it. it. Yeah, it's pretty heavy. It's pretty heavy. <laughs> Wait, there's three kinds? Uh -uh. Uh, I, I can already one. feel the fries don't feel cooked well. Y'all are hungry, huh? Mm hmm. Would you have a smoke today, no, Mario, or what, meat. man? Oh, the meat seasoning. That's a good amount of cheese, good amount of guac and sour cream. Mm -hmm. The meat yeah. seasoning? That meat's good. Mm. The lack of sauce is pissing me off. Alright, let's give this a shot. Mm. Sauce is okay. They they really sauce. Is different, or is that the same? Oh, yeah, wait, there's is three kinds. Third kind? Yeah, there's a third kind. Dude, how are they gonna give us three? Like, what the fuck, dude? Whoa! Yo, juicy first bite. I really juicy. The sauce is making me mad. Yeah, the orange one's like coming out. Mmm. It's too sour. The, the, green one, sour. the green one's pretty sour. Is it? Mm -hmm. Both of them. Which one should I try? This one, the green one, and the. Leave it for us. I like the amount of cheese. Is that all of it? Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. That's oh. it, dude. Warm. Cheese is melted. I mean, it's all right. We're going to go with cell side. Right. Mm. There's no sauce. No sauce, and the fries are. The fries are sauce. It's got a sweet flavor. Mm. I do like yeah, that the sauces the one you're about to... have three distinct flavors, at least. Yeah. Yeah. This one's sour, that one's sweet. The sauces, they're, yeah. they're, they're definitely, like, strong. It's not enough. Mm-hmm. What the fuck's the logo? Chili? Pepper? Mm-hmm. So pepper is smiling or yelling or something. Who picked this place? I did. Is it Gary? Yeah. It is. It is Gary. Good burrito. No. The fries are a little crispier, it would probably be the best. Mm hmm. Definitely. I don't know about the best, but. Really? It'd be up there. If they had crispy fries, because the ratio was solid in this yeah. one, the amount of meat to fries to sour cream and guac and cheese pretty was pretty good. And I'm a hardcore cheese guy. I love the fucking layer, yeah. layer of cheese in it. You bite in and get like yeah. a cool ball of cheese. The melted cheese, yeah. They need to work on their salsa. But yeah, they need to work on giving me more sauce. Really. I like the I, end of the burrito. I like the beginning. It's like a case burrito at the bottom. Is it? Mm. I could eat another one. Dude, it's good. It's it a good burrito. That's a good burrito. Looks like those crispy their fries properly. Crispy fries. Slightly more meat to fry ratio. They'd be on point. And slightly more cooked tortilla. Yeah, but it yeah, tortilla is a little. No pico. No, no pico in this one. No pico. I had a tomato when I first unwrapped my burrito, like stuck to the side of it. Mm -hmm. Tastes like pico. Yeah. You ride the, the ending? It's a good burrito. It's a good Probably burrito. More, I like the cheese. It's a good burrito. It's a really good rating. All right, Slicko here. Week three, season one, Burrito Boys Club. We went to Lupe's over by Mesa College. This won't be the first time you hear somebody say Lupe's by Mesa College. I'll go ahead and rate it. Tortilla, average, 8. Meat, decent, 20. Mixins, good, 20. Salsa, minimal, but good. I give it a 10. I think if we would have asked for more, I would have given it a higher ranking. There's something about a burrito just got to be dripping with the salsa. You can't just have a little little dip, dipping dots here and there. You know what I'm saying? You got to have a good amount. That's why I give the salsa a 10. You wrap all that up, I give this burrito a 62. Here's the deal. Lupe's Mesa College. It was a it was a good burrito. 
actually is probably one of the best burritos. I think I'm gonna give this one the highest score that I've had so far. It's uh, probably the first one that was properly, the layers were consistent all the way through. You weren't getting like little, little mines of, of ingredients here and there with each bite. It was every bite going all the way through it had all the ingredients that you needed, which was meat, sour cream, cheese, guac, and fries. The fries though could have been, they could have been more crispy. That's probably the, the big downside to this burrito. If they had more crispy fries, this burrito would be getting, a, be getting an A. <clears throat> but they didn't give us enough sauce. Sauces were delicious, but they only gave us like seven sauces for seven burritos. But there were three different kinds broken up into that. So we didn't even have enough of each sauce for each burrito, which is ridiculous. And on top of that, when I was paying for the order, over the phone, they had the audacity to ask for a tip on the phone when I'm going there to pick it up. That's no bueno. So a zero on customer service. But the burrito gets an 82. What's going on, BBC? It's your boy Burrito Mars here. Uh, season one, episode three. Tonight we went to, well, I didn't go, my fellow cousins went to Lupe, uh, next to Mesa College. <laughs> I think this was, uh, I think this was Freddy's spot. This burrito was good. Oh, Alright, Burrito Mars review. Let's start with the burrito. Uh, it was good. Burrito was really good. It had fries, cheese, meat, guac and sour cream. Consistency perfect. Layers were spot on. Not enough salsa though, so we were, you know, we were doing dipping dots, like Liko said, but, um, salsa was good. It wasn't too bad. It was average. Um, uh, shit, where am I going with this? Uh, the size of the burrito was really good. By far, this is a really good burrito, man. This is a really good burrito. I'm going to have to give it a overall score of 81. Burrito Mars signing out. Lupe's Mesa College. It's a good burrito. Um, good burrito, good flavor. Um, the salsa was really good, but we didn't get enough of it. The meat was really good. It was good. Uh, it was proportioned pretty ev evenly throughout the whole burrito. Fries could have been crispier, and my burrito could have been rolled a little bit tighter. But aside from that, um, didn't have pico, but I feel like with the amount of cheese in this, the pico wouldn't have been good. Um, but I like the burrito. Uh, I'll give it a 79. Yeah. Lupe's. This is an above average burrito, I thought. Uh, was missing a lot of sauce. It's pretty sad that I got no sauce to add to my burrito, so I didn't finish about half of it. But otherwise, it was a good burrito. The meat was delicious. Uh, a lot of cheese, which I liked. Fries were a bit soggy. Wasn't a big fan of that. Um, it could have been rolled tighter. It was a it wasn't as airy as the last couple burritos, but it was it was good. Uh, overall score, I think I'll give it a 70. Morito here. Um, Morito. 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 <laughs> Burrito was good. Burrito was great, actually. Um, start off with typically when you finish a burrito, the very end of it is just dry and just full of fries. And right off, you know, right when I got to the end, it was just super filled with sour cream, cheese, guac to the very end. That kind of leads to the consistency. It was spot on throughout the whole entire burger, uh, not burger, burrito. Um, that's rare in a burrito in my opinion. And so solid 10 out of 10 on, on the toppings great uh first bite going in tasted meat well seasoned well cooked i think uh the meat was probably the best meat out of all the burritos in my opinion um tortilla was overall i mean it was just just held it all together i mean they did its job it was nicely cooked warm um salsa disappointing uh flavors were mixed up you know, I didn't even know what which one I had at the end because we we're all sharing it, and that was kind of disappointing. When you buy a burrito, you should get one flavor 
per burrito. And with um, with uh, the customer service lacking, we didn't get much. So besides the salsa, I think the burrito is spot on. I give that a 82. Lupe's by Mesa College. This was a really good burrito. Um, first things first, it had a lot of cheese, a lot of melty cheese. I love cheese in my burrito, so that was good. Um, fries were a little bit soggy. Um, the meat to fry ratio was a little low. Could have been slightly higher, but still a decent amount of meat. The meat was good. Um, good steak. Sauces, there were three sauces. One was like a sour orangey, one was a sour green, and one was a smoky red. Uh, they were all pretty good. What else? Sour cream and guac, if you have both of those and evenly distributed, perfect. Um, tortilla could have been cooked a little more. Overall, I'll say 80. And that's it for Lupe's by Mesa College. Thank you. F-bomb out. So, overall. what's our overall? I think Freddie had the best part of review here. Did I? And then, um, did we start reviewing the reviews? Okay, <laughs> okay let's go back through them. <laughs> you guys are fucking thirsty. This burrito no way gets over 75. What? He goes, I wrap it all together. You're, what did you give it? <laughs> Alright, we're here to discuss Lupe's. What's 75 on the list? I think this is slightly better than Cotillon. We should I'll definitely give this a new Plus 74. Albert's 75. Way better than Albert's. It's better than Albert's. Way better than Albert's and better than Lucha. Close in your burrow. 78. This is yeah, better, than burrow. better than burrows. Better than burrows. Better than burrows. It's like an 83. You guys don't have Cotillas. You didn't even put burrows in my favorite. It was on a different paper. Burrows is my favorite. There's a new paper somewhere. You don't have this at all this season. Oh, here we go. Rancho Villas. Cotillas Navajo Blank. Rancho Villas, 69. See, Rancho Villas, 69. Rancho Villas was good. 79, 80. 80's the highest score you ever got. I don't think this was the highest score you ever got. I think got. this was the best burrito we've had. Cotixin is higher than Senior Burrow anyways, and this is higher than Cotixin. <sighs> so I don't know, we're gonna have to go back. We can't even be discussing season zero picks anyways. Yes, that should I'll never happen. Relevant. The thing you gotta do is this is a 75. This is definitely better than Cotillas on Neville. This is more than a 75. This is way better than Cotillas on Neville. This is definitely like Cotillas on Neville 50. I would give him a fucking zero. Look, if we're giving this 75, I want to give it a 25 because that's just unacceptable. We might as well, well just. This place falls anywhere between a 78 to an 83. 100%. 81. This is the best I'll burrito. I'll do an 81. I'll accept I'd 81. agree to an 81. This is not the best burrito I've eaten. <laughs> That's why the one. What's That's the best one you be in? What's the best burrito you be in? Cotillas on Navajo. Tega, I thought it was good. El Azteca was good, but distribution Alberts was weak. Alberts was good. Wrap it all together, a 40. Alberts was, I don't even remember Alberts. Oh, yeah. Alberts was heavy. I remember one of them was really good. 81? 80. 81. It's better than Cotixin. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta retry all these places. <laughs> Yeah. What did you guys all score it? it I gave it an 80. Right? 80. 80 is my highest rating I've ever given a burrito. I 79, think. 79, I gave it a 62. Boom, 75. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's not just an average, it's a discussion. But you also got to consider this is the highest score you've ever given a fucking burrito. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> I'm turning a new leaf. Trying to, trying to lo loosen up a little bit. Exactly, uh, loosen the fuck up. Agree to an 81. Yeah, 81's too high. It's an 80. <laughs> we're not I'll gonna, give it a we're 79. Not gonna, we're not gonna bring down the, everyone else. 79 and a half. Guy 80. Who gives every burrito a 20. <laughs> you guys have a better day. <laughs> <laughs> let's do 78. No, no, let's just stick with 80, 81, 81, bro. 81. 80.5. Write down the 81. Write the 81 on the page. This is it. Bro, I took a bite out of the burrito. 81's not even that oh, high. Man. Why are you guys crying? It's, it's, yeah, we're not even in the 90s yet. Yeah. Lupe's yeah. by Mesa College, 81. That's it. Thank you for your opinion. <laughs>